Hello friends, welcome back. Hearty welcome to you. Let us look at this in interesting problem asked by one of the students. We have been given that cos to the power of 4x by cos square y plus sin to the power of 4x by sin square y equals to 1. We have to prove that cos to the power of 4y by cos square x plus sin to the power of 4y by sin square x equals to 1. So this is given to us. We have to prove this. So I'll start with what is given to us. And we'll try to convert that into, we see that the equation is in cos and sin. We'll try to convert that completely into sin so that we can simplify and get a condition which we can satisfy in the second equation and prove that the value equal to 1. So let's start now. We'll try to finish this first. Cos to the power of 4x. How can we write it? 1 minus sin square x whole square divided by 1 minus sin square y plus sin to the power of 4x divided by sin square y equals to 1. Now let's open the bracket here. We will have 1 1 plus sin to the power of 4x minus 2 sin square x divided by 1 minus sin square y plus sin to the power of 4x divided by sin square y equals to 1. Let's take LCM. We will have sin square y into 1 plus sin to the power of 4x minus 2 sin square x plus sin to the power of 4x into 1 minus sin square y divided by sin square y into 1 minus sin square y equal to 1. Let's open the brackets. We have sin square y plus sin to the power of 4x sin square y minus 2 sin square x sin square y plus sin to the power of 4x minus sin square y or sin to the power of 4x sin square y sin to the power of 4x divided by sin square y into 1 minus sin square y equal to 1. Now can I cancel something here? Let us see what we can cancel. We can cancel sin square y sin to the power of 4x and then we will try to take the denominator to right hand side. The next step will be sin square y sin square y minus 2 sin square x sin square y plus sin to the power of 4x is equal to sin square y into 1 minus sin square y in denominator. If you multiply, you get sin square y minus sin to the power of 4y. Now you can see sin square y, sin square y, I can cancel them. So let me go ahead and cancel sin square y and sin square y and get everything to left hand side and see what happens. We will have sin to the power of 4x minus 2 sin square x sin square y plus sin to the power of 4y equal to 0. This is like a square minus 2ab plus b square equals to 0 which is a minus b whole square equal to 0. What is our a here? Sin square x minus sin square y whole square equal to 0. Or can I say sin square x equals to sin square y? That means sin x equals to sin y. Or can I say x equals to y? Or we can also say sin square x equals to sin square y means cos square x equals to cos square y. Now once we get this sin square x equals to sin square y and cos square x equals to cos square y, we can either take it as x equals to y and we can put down in the second one. We have cos to the power of 4y by cos square y plus sin to the power of 4y by sin square y which is cos square y plus sin square y which is equals to 1. So x equals to y, any value of x equals to y will satisfy 
both the equations and both of them will be equal to 1. So we got sin square x equals to sin square y which is gives us cos square x equals to cos square y or we can also take that sin x equals to sin y x equals to y maybe x equals to plus or minus y that is also fine but we can stop here sin square x equals to sin square y cos square x equals to cos square y so I can convert them into completely into one variable instead of x and y into y I can write down cos to the power of 4 y that is cos to the power of 4 x by cos square x plus sin to the power of 4 y that is sin square x divided by sin square x sin to the power of 4 x by sin square x this is nothing but equal to cos square x plus sin square x we know cos square theta plus sin square theta is 1 so that's how we can prove that it's equals to 1